Hi, Sarah the Closed Mine. It's a quick night tonight. I actually don't have a lot. I have like half a rack. Um, very little in accessories, so it's going to be a short video night. But that's okay, because then <laughs> Sunny was like, you have to update about Carl to everyone. Carl the spider. If all of you recall who watched the video last week, there was a spider. I'm going to actually put a chapter tag on, because there's a few of you who are a little traumatized about the spider. So I don't want you to be traumatized. I want you to be able to skip past the spider story. Um, but I have to update because it was like really my entire week and it was pretty amazing. So I have to tell you about it. Um, other than that, I thought weirdly this was my last video and then I was sad and I didn't want it to be my last video because I have surgery in two weeks, less than two weeks now. Um, I go for my pre-op appointment tomorrow and next Tuesday is July the 4th and we will be closed. Again, remember we will be closed on July 4th. No matter how much you want to celebrate July 4th, right here in the store, we are not going to do that. There is no celebration of July 4th in the store. There is a celebration of Canada Day in the store. I'm not even going to tell you what it is. got to Google that if you don't know already, and then you can come in and we're doing spin the wheel. Um, but July the 4th, we will not be here. We will be having July the 4th with our families. And... So the, I thought this is my last video because I won't have one next Tuesday because it's the 4th. That made me sad, so I'm going to try to figure out how to do one more video before I go. Whether that's the last day before I leave, like Saturday, I don't know. I'm going to figure it out. It's going to happen probably the Saturday, maybe the Thursday. I could do the Thursday. I'm here Thursday. I'm going to switch it up and maybe do it on the Thursday. Anyways, it's going to be a surprise. It's going to be a surprise email video. Probably will be a fair bit because I really have to get through everything before I go away for three weeks. Um, so it should be fun. There you have it. Now I told you all the updates. You've got all the details. The next video back will be August 1st. So yes, it was like it was going to be a whole month without a video. And I was like, ah, that's crazy. But anyways, Carl. I am doing this because Carl deserves his story told. So those of you who watched last week, you recall that there was a spider in my shower on Tuesday morning. And it was a lot of internet research trying to figure out what the spider was. He was kind of brown black. He's about, you know, but just under an inch, big, furry, tarantula-like. Um, we shared a shower together. He ran around my ceiling in my bathroom. So I told you all about him last week, Tuesday in the video. The week got epic after that. Um, so I got home and Carl was gone. I think it was, so it was Wednesday night. It was definitely Wednesday night. So Wednesday night, I go back in and Carl is in the bathroom. And it was later at night and I'm like, he's way up in the corner in the ceiling. And I'm like, what is he doing? And he's watching me again. Cause I told you last week, he was a little creepy with his watching. And apparently, cause he's a jumping spider. We did some research, he's a jumping spider. Um, he was like watching me. So he's staring at me. And I'm staring back and I'm like, okay. And then he starts to turn. So he's sitting up in the corner and he's like turning around, watching me doing this thing. And I realize he's wrapping himself in his web. So this was super cool. So I watch him for a while and it's pretty amazing watching him wrap himself in his web. And I'm thinking, I can't stay up here forever doing this. So I have to go watch, a, cause it's our ritual to watch a TV show at night. So my husband's like, where are you? I'm like, I'm watching Carl. Um, so I Google that and apparently the juvenile males, which we had decided he was because he has orange spots on his back, will wrap themselves in their web, a cocoon, when they're molting. And that can go on for five hours versus days, depending on how old they are and what they're doing. So Carl wraps himself in his little web and I have pictures if you guys want pictures. I'm going to send you Carl pictures um, of him and he, his little cocoon, and he sits up there. And he proceeds to sit up there for days. <laughs> so finally on Thursday night, I'm noticing, it was, okay, it was like a day and a half or whatever. But Thursday night, I'm noticing he, it's a movement. He's moving up in his little cocoon. I'm like, well, he's up to something. And then Friday morning, he's still there, and he's moving around his little cocoon. I'm like, okay, he's getting rambunctious in there. Um, and then I go up Friday morning, later in the morning around 10 and he's gone 
he just vanished. And I'm like, oh no, because I had read that when they come out of their cocoon, they're very thirsty and they're very hungry because they have not eaten or had anything to drink in however long they've been in it, which in Carl's case was since like Wednesday. So I'm very worried about him, but I can't find him anywhere. I don't know where he's gone. So finally, I'm heading here to the store on Friday. I go upstairs to brush my teeth and get ready like any good citizen. Yes, I brush my teeth. Um, and I see Carl in the shower. So I go and I get my bug, I have a bug container and a piece of cardboard that I use to rescue moths lately because of the moth explosion. Um, a bee once and, and now Carl. So I go in to get Carl and Carl has transformed. So most of you have to look up the bold jumper because they start as this kind of, as a juvenile male, this brown black spider kind of blah looking with a few orange spots on the back. Not very distinctive. They come out of their cocoon, super distinctive. He is now black and white. He's got this gorgeous white spot. He's got black and white stripes. He's beautiful, but he has these vibrant, like iridescent green eyes. It's unbelievable. He has completely transformed. I will show you pictures of that as well. Um, it's amazing. It's totally cool. So I get Carl in the container to take him outside because bold jumper, and he's a bold jumper, they are not house spiders because they don't build webs. They hunt their prey visually, so that's why they're very good eyesight, um, during the day and jump at them. So they kill bugs, other bugs, ants, all the things you want gone. Apparently the weevil, the bull weevil, they're a big fan of the bull weevil, um, which is very good for cotton and in the benefit of cotton. So Carl, I set Carl free in the world, and so Carl is free in the world as a bull jumper now, an adult male, and hopefully he can live one to three years, so hopefully he does, and finds a mate, and makes other bull jumpers, and that's my Carl story. It was long, I admit it, but it was a short video tonight, so you can skip past it if you want, you don't have to listen about Carl. We're gonna get into the video now, but I'm telling you, watching Carl transform was like the greatest event of this year, I think. It was pretty spectacular. Um, never seen it. Rarely you're gonna see that because they don't normally come inside. So it was a great moment in my life, so I had to share it with you. All right, back to the clothes. We're going to Extra Smalls. And this says I spent like five minutes telling you about Carl, but that's okay. You were gonna listen to it when you came in the store anyways. I was going to tell you. Um, all right, now I just shared it with all of you. Extra smalls. We have the most fun thing. This could be a dress. It was made in Kenya. It could be a dress. Could be a jacket. Your choice. Uh, $32.99. It's amazing. It's a fan. It's fans. It's super fun. I love it. Um, obviously, it's way too tiny for me being an extra small, but it's super cool. And that's, I'm sure, hand-dyed fabric. It's printed, printed fabric. It's lovely. All right. Uh, free people, $15.99 for this tank top. Very cute as well. That's my extra smalls. I don't even have any men's today. It's honestly, it's a short video today. But that's all right, you got to hear about Carl. Which was important to me. All right, $21, $11.99, lightweight black tank top. Pretty sheer, new with tags, Vonda, $15.99, white blouse. New with tags, Jag Jeans, jeans, size six, $24.99. These are a straight leg. Um, brand new. Gorgeous skirt by Fow. Looks like a Pharaoh, Fow, Pharaoh. Um, $15.99, again, just beautiful printed fabric, love it. Nice cotton, gorgeous dress. Chick is the brand, $21.99. It is, um, I'm trying to read it. Hold on, you're gonna see it. It's like a patterned, very beautiful, classic dress. Absolutely stunning. It's all about dresses this week. In the video and next week. Next week, I just got in a ton of gorgeous dresses. This, including this one, which is now up, it's beautiful. It was worn in a dance competition. You gotta see the bottom, it's like fringy with beads. It's stunning. I had a moment and a half getting it on here though. Don't talk to me about it. Um, it's ECI, size six, 
I had a moment and a half getting it on, I'm gonna tell you now, because of that under thing, and it twisted, mm, don't even talk to me about it. All right, it's bordering on, remember that, I don't know if all of you remember that wrap dress I had that tied on the side, and it was a torture. This was close. I had to count to 10 a couple times to calm myself. All right, $6.99 for some elephant pants. Who doesn't want those? Oh, this is amazing. I tried it on. It's not quite a medium. It's a little snug in the body. It, is, it does have some longer arms though, which was nice because it did fit. This is Austrian. It's beautiful. Um, $38.99. So I put it in the smalls because it is a bit of a snug fit. And hold on. I'm just moving it because I think I saw a, a, a moth hole on it. So hold on that thought until I get that one sorted because we don't want that. Harvey Bernard, size 4. I checked it over carefully, but sometimes I miss them in the light. $21.99. Beautiful cream blazer. Stunning. Kate Hill. I love this shirt. $12.99 with the wrap. Call I call it a wrap collar, I suppose. And Spencer Jeremy, size 4. This is linen, $11.99. Gorgeous. Gorgeous top. I feel like that should be more. It's super beautiful. I feel like that should be more. Sonoma, small. $16.99. Classic jean jacket. And that is our smalls. Moving on to mediums. Uh, this is a Hawaiian brand, Niji Fashion, so it's $18.99. It is nice. It's very stretchy. Um, it says one size. I would go medium. Medium on it. You might be able to do a large, maybe. Could be a small, too, I guess. Um, ink, $16.99. Silver, silver cardigan. Love it. Karen Stevens, 10 Petite, $17.99. Very classic dress. Flowery dress, made in heaven, $15.99. I love this dress, it's so pretty. Um, Tommy Hilfiger, size 10, $19.99. Just polka dots, it's got a liner. It's a great feel to it. I love this dress too. Taylor, $21.99, classic. And that was a size 10 as well, if I didn't say that. Uh, Coldwater Creek set. This is a sleeveless knit and a small short sleeve cardigan wrap. $18.99 for the set. So pretty. I had to keep it together. It was just too pretty. Um, it's lovely. Fun giraffe shirt. Who doesn't need a giraffe shirt? $11.99 by Chico's. It's a, it's fun. It's giraffes. A vintage leather jacket made in Korea. So this is a size 12, but I would put it more as a medium. Um, it's pretty amazing. $32.99. IZOD Golf, size 10, $14.99. This is a very nice skort. And if I didn't say it before, it's a skort. It's a golf skort. Uh, Chano, $9.99. I also really like this. It's got stars on it. Perfect for the fourth. You guys got to run in and get that. Wear that over like a blue or red tank top. It'd be really cute. All right. Alex evening gown. This is brand new with tags. So it's $65.99. It's size 10. <clears throat> new with tags. It's a very classic evening. Love this one. Marina. Size 10 as well. $21.99. Very lovely. Evening dress. Um, this feels vintage. This is made in Italy. It's probably just European. Primavera, $18.99. It has a lovely feel to it. Garnet Hill, size 10, $19.99. A little more of a flapper vibe to it. It's more of a slip dress. Beautiful Tank by Anna, $6.99. I just love the color. It's so great. 21, also love the color of this, $9.99. I just love the color of that one too. Green, perfect. Uh, Betsy Adam dress, size 8, $24.99. This is quite lovely. Zip up the back. 
I don't know if you saw that. Hold on, let me hold it up. So over the back, and then there's another zip on the bottom. It's a nice dress. I like it a lot. All right, and hybrid apparel, new with tags, $17.99. Pair of white leggings. They're not really athletic wear, they're more almost like a jean wear. All right, on to larges. A casual jumper romper, connected apparel size 12, 1999. Got a little bit of silver vibe for ya. Oh, I totally love this skirt. I love it, beyond words. Ralph Lauren Golf, which you all know I have a soft spot for. Um, <clears throat> size 12, 14.99. I love this. Wish it was my size, it's breaking my heart. This is the cutest golf skirt ever. Did I mention I love it? I love it. I would almost put on weight so I could wear this. Almost. Maybe after my surgery, because I'm, you know, I'm gonna sit around and do nothing for weeks on end, I'll be able to fit this. Could be an upside to surgery and doing nothing. We'll see. Tommy Hilfiger, eleven ninety nine. Uh, Jessica Howard dress. This is a petite. I'm gonna tell you the price. Fifteen ninety nine is a size twelve. Size twelve petite. Fifteen ninety nine. Tommy Hilfiger, size fourteen. Nineteen ninety nine. This one is super cute as well. I really like this dress. It's like daisies, but not daisies. Bar three, twelve ninety nine. Beautiful green top. Green is also the theme of today. A lot of green going on. This is almost a green. This is Brisus. I love this top as well. Just a, and I, I would like to tell you the price, but I don't have a price. There it is. Uh, nine ninety nine. I love it. Guys are blue blouse, eleven ninety nine. Great color. Kind of like the color I'm wearing. Ha <laughs> ha. That's not why it's great. It's just great in general. London Times, size fourteen, seventeen ninety nine. This is long, so yeah, I could almost get away with it with sandals. But it is a long dress. It's nice. Pair of jean shorts, size fourteen, nine ninety nine by seven. Brand new swimsuit with tags. Um, Liz Claiborne swimwear. This is $29.99. It is brand new. Again, one of those ones that's really nice with that sort of gathering. <clears throat> it's very flattering. Uh, Skort. Lucy, $13.99. And last but not least, a billabong, $11.99. I really like that top too. It's got a really nice feel to it. All right, XL. It would have been a lot quicker if I hadn't told you about Carl, but I had to tell you about Carl. He was so great. All right, notations, $13.99 for a long cardigan. It's actually really fun. Melissa Page, $9.99, short sleeve shirt. Uh, I love this shirt. Uh, Lauren Conrad, eleven ninety nine. Love this shirt. Love the little fringe on the sleeves. Super cute fringe on the bottom. Love that shirt. Love these shorts. Patagonia, size sixteen, twelve ninety nine. So super cute. And last but not least, Knox Rose, eleven ninety nine. All right. That is that I have only a couple shoes to show you these Vashley Mishkas they actually go with um, one of the dresses that I have and they are a size eight and a half this dress that was in the mediums they're exactly matched color they were for that they were not worn nor was the dress because it's new with tags um, so these are Vashley Mishka jewel shoes $32.99 some dust on them. Uh, super cute. And then a pair of coach flip flops for $8.99. Size 7 8. That is literally my shoes. I got a bit more in the odds and ends department though. If I could write numbers down. 
All right, I have a fun puzzle. If I didn't already have like two puzzles backlogged with all my puzzles, I'd get this one because it's cats. It's true. Um, it is a pretty perfect puzzle. I'm not kidding. It's got a certificate of authenticity on the bottom back. Uh, it's $6.99. It says it's a limited edition collector puzzle. I don't know. If I get a puzzle, I'm cracking it open and doing it. I'm not saving it. So people, you want a cat puzzle, go ahead and get this one. Cat puzzle. I have the cutest little uh, made in Japan little pot. Hold on, I'm going to show you the side. It's cute. So adorable. I love it. It is $14.99 for a tiny little pot. Adorable. You use it as a little creamer pot. This is a necklace. It was meant to, actually it was worn with the Kenya dress. Uh, $14.99. Styled necklace. Magnetic. Wax painted handmade artisan candle. $9.99. New in the box. Um, party light candle, new in the box, $8.99. It's a big, tall pillar candle. I think these things last forever. Um, so there you go. And I have a basket, Longa Burger. Longa Burger. Um, $18.99. This is like a serving tray. I'm actually quite fond of this one. Um, just a nice tray. Maybe I need to get this one. I was just thinking it would be nice if we had our stuff on the table in a tray and then you could take it off when you clean the table instead of having to take off each individual item. I'm going to think on this one. Now somebody's going to come in and go, yes, that's genius. I'm buying that for that reason. That's what happens. That's what I do. That's how I give to you all. I not only tell you about Carl, I tell you about how to use the tray. All right. Um, I nattered on there a little bit, so my closing, I'm not completely one. Oh, I have one more odds and end. Oops. I have to change my closing. Uh, signature. This is a beach cover-up loungy thing, $13.99. It's very pretty. Very pretty. Beautiful colors. Wear that with that bathing suit. All right. Changing my closing. $22.07. All right. Not bad. I got done in record time, even telling you about Carl, so I'm pretty proud of that. Um, as I said in the beginning, we are going to celebrate Canada Day. We are going to not be here July 4th. Do not come here July 4th. I'm putting a sign on the door as well. We are not here. We're not going to be here. It's not going to happen. Um, other than that, I'm hoping to do a video still next week because I didn't want to be a whole month of a video, which would be weird. Um, I'm hoping to still do a video next week. It's going to be a surprise day. Surprise day video. It's going to happen, I hope. All right. I hope to see you, I guess, Canada Day. Other than that, thanks for watching.